Good morning, besties. All right, we're gonna go do some self-care hygiene shopping today. Honestly, y'all, my hair looks so bad. It looks so, I hate it. Anyways, we're gonna go do some shopping today. I don't really need anything, but I wanna kind of see what there is. Is there anything new that came out? Maybe will we find some goodies because I'm gonna go to a few different places. So of course I wanna take out with me. So let's go see if we have any luck finding anything. Y'all, my car is so freaking dirty. Like, gross. I need to clean it. Y'all, it is so hot in Texas that this new like phone holder is good but it's just so hot that it's literally like melting so i can't even keep it up in my car because it doesn't stay up so it just like it falls it'll randomly fall i have my phone mountain and then boom it just falls and i'm like oh my gosh like does anybody know a solution for that i have it on my windshield i don't i can't put it on the thing like it doesn't stick on the dash so only the windshield and it keeps falling it just keeps falling all right first stop tj maxx let's see if they've stocked anything at all it's also a monday i wanted to come on monday because i feel like it'll be less people here and looking at the parking lot this is the least amount of cars i've ever seen here this is usually a good location so let's go inside and see what we can find i just walked through the purses y'all check out my tiktok because they had the best purses today okay but moving on self-care and hygiene they do have a lot of super super cute clips i always like that like so cute oh these are nice how much are they 12.99 these are cute oh my gosh and they are so stocked on nails too especially halloween nails how cute they have this brand at walmart it is so good i definitely recommend it look how cute like they're literally filled both sides with so many nails I feel like at one point this brand was big, but not so much. Has anybody tried it? Is it good? I really do love this Acure. Like, seriously use it every time when I shower. It is so great. And then I've been seeing this a lot, so I don't know if this is good. Anybody try this? They really do have a lot of good perfumes out today, too. Like, I smell a lot of these, and a lot of them smell really good, except for this. This smells so, so freaking bad. They have a lot of body mists, too. I've also been starting to see some milk products, like a lot more, so that's pretty cool. This stuff is amazing. I cannot recommend it enough. Like two pack for $10, I recommend, but you can also get them individually for $5.99. I think I actually have this brand at home, so that's kind of cool, but it doesn't really whiten that much. Like it's a pretty low percentage, but not bad. We got some diva curl i love looking over here though i kind of want some like whitening stuff so i don't know if i want like whitening toothpaste or if i want to get something like this but girl needs a little whitening i'm also starting to see a lot of these smile direct products i don't know if they're any good but there's also a lot of like serums and like you kind of see how this place it's like just so messy but if you pick through it you can find good things all right i'm seeing some good brands i actually like this and here it's 12.99 but i've used it more than once and it's actually not that bad some Josiah. Ooh, i feel like i've heard of this brand before 5.99 anybody try this i recommend this so much it has made i've used it only twice and it's already made my skin so freaking soft it's like 12.99 definitely recommend this and i love the lineage lip sleeping masks these are amazing too they last me all night i wake up and it's still on my lips Ooh, eyeshadow primer ten dollars oh what is this ten dollars plumping lip gloss oh that's cute we have some Versace, okay, I like that. Some Capari, Pisa, oh, okay. I tried the strips, uh, I'm still undecided. I don't know if I like it or not. I got some Truly, they have a few good things if you like pick through here, but everything's kind of been like picked through, so it's kind of been open, so there's nothing really like fresh out i have been wanting to try origins though anybody try it anybody recommend any good products from origin look how cute but i literally don't smell anything 
Like I tried smelling through this hole, maybe it's like she sealed shut, but I can't smell anything. I'm starting to see a lot more Hollister too, like clothes wise and like beauty wise. I love this brand, has anybody tried this specific product? I've heard good things about this powder. Anybody try it? Look at this little set for $15. That's pretty cute. And you get this little bag. This is so cute. I wish TJ Maxx had like testers so you can smell what things look like without having to open anything. Look how cute this is. The little scooper, $5.99. Got some more scrubs and lotions. I swear, every time I come, I see more and more Ollie vitamins, which is awesome. I've tried them before and I really do like them, so I do recommend them. But they are stepping up on their vitamin selections. This is really interesting. $5. Ooh, but these taste pretty good. I wonder if they actually work. Look how pretty this is. They have a lot of things that they can put out. I just like pick through it. They have a lot of lipsticks, especially MAC lipsticks, more milk products. So that's pretty cool. I'm so tempted to get this and try it. Like they really do have some goodies today. And look at this pretty nail polish, $4.99. It's a really good brand. I love OPI. These are definitely perfect for a nice self-care day. Paint your nails. Look how many pretty colors they have. Also love this. $11.99. This is so worth it. These are my favorite sponges ever. Ooh, and they have more tree hub products back here. So they're $5.99. And they have a lot of Bautiste. Bautiste? Am I saying that right? But I feel like I'm not allowed to look on here, but there's some goodies. These. I am being extra shy today. I am so anxious. I don't know what it is. Maybe because I didn't get enough sleep and eat, but I am so, like, I'm so shy. But I'm kind of finishing up here. I'm not really finding that much, but I am tempted to try this. I used to use charcoal on my teeth before, and it really did help with whitening. But I think I might be heading out soon. This dress is cute and all. But it's so tight, like, I'm like walking like a penguin. Like, your girl can't move. But, I need to get out of this section, so let's go. Like, let's go to Target and see. Hopefully, Target's not too busy, because I know Target's pretty busy, like, a lot of the times. But I don't usually hygiene shop there. Y'all know I go to H-E-B. I might even stop by H-E-B, too. But since there's a Target, like, literally right here, let me just swing by and see if we do find anything. I still have a love-hate relationship with Target. Because every time I want something or need something and it's only at Target, it's literally never there. So, I don't know how I feel about this. Right, I don't know if I've talked about pads before, but these are my favorite. I always get number three or four. Literally, the best pads. They don't irritate me. They're so comfortable. They're long-lasting. I hate that the prices went up so much, but they're literally the best pads on the market. And I'm loving these, but I get them at TJ Maxx and I get the ones that are herbal because they're like a minty fresh feeling and they're cheaper at TJ Maxx. All right, we may have better luck finding things here. It's not too crowded and it looks like they kind of stuck. I actually use this exact one, same brand, but I get it off of Amazon. It's $30 here on Amazon. It's usually on sale, but I do recommend it. I actually really like it and they have one for detox and digest. I have been wanting to try the Bloom one, but this is also $30 and it's only 4.8 ounces while this one is 8.5. So this one is so much worth the price than this one. Oh, this is only $30. That's not bad. And this for hair is also $30. These are actually pretty good. I'm so tempted to get this. I've been wanting to try the Bondi Boost and I love the BB products. And then some of these other things I'm just interested in. Same with that. Absolutely love this. Always keep one in my purse. But I usually just have the original. Y'all know these are my go-to creams, especially these body lotions. You can't go wrong. I have been wanting to try this eyelash serum. I do currently have one from Amazon, but if anybody's tried it, let me know if it's good. But I do love Ordinary products. So far, everything I've used from there is great. I feel like this would be a dupe to the Origin only because it looks similar, but let me know what other products should I try from the Ordinary. I forgot there was an Ulta inside of Target, so I'm just kind of like looking around at everything to see, but they're a little bit empty in the Ulta section. This is my absolute favorite hair oil. 
oil i would definitely spend the money i mean 45 dollars. i got it when it was on sale at ulta i got it a year and a half ago and it's almost still completely full and i use it every time i wash my hair you know i thought i liked living proof but i don't think i do the products that i've used i don't think work for my hair it makes my hair really oily it weighs it down so i personally don't recommend it for like fine thin hair but it might work for some others if there's some other products you think are good i'd love to try it i know i've tried this product and it's okay it's not bad and i've tried this but in like a different spray version and i'm not really fond of it but i did try the hair mask of this and i do like that and i do recommend that i use it like once a week i think it was this one yeah i think it was this one right here and i do recommend it there are a lot of good things about buxom i haven't tried any of their glosses yet i haven't found any but i don't want to pay the full price here so i'm still like searching at ulta to see if i can find it but i want to find like the plumping ones because they're 28 dollars here but i hear good things about them ColourPop is also a really good brand i used to use it all the time and i kind of stopped but it's, it's a really good brand i do recommend now elf has been stepping up the game with so many good products there's not one thing that i've tried from elf that i do not like i love the hydrating skincare line it is my favorite i love the setting spray the all night one i love the sun touchable i love the camel i love the primers i love the foundations literally y'all so great i'm just so sad that the prices are really going up i know this is one of their newer products they come in like a little circle thing but they made it like this like liquid version which i think would be great but i just don't need it right now but when i run out of my like compact one i'll definitely be grabbing that but this entire line like yes i love this i love this love it love it love it love it love it love all. from l'oreal i love these currently i have this one and i'm wearing it today under my makeup absolutely love it it's such a good purchase also l'oreal lipsticks have to be one of my favorite drugstore lipsticks they're always so creamy so light so beautiful huge shade range this target does not have a huge shade range of the l'oreal they do at HUB. Look how cute these nails are from LA girl. They're only $5.99. So cute. I've been hearing really good things about this foundation. Um, I really like the L'Oreal one, but I've heard good things about this one. And these two are my current lash combo. I go in with this first and then this to top it off. And it's not been too bad. I'm still playing around with it, but it's pretty good. A little close up. I really like this brand. It's been good to me. Derma E is also a pretty good brand. And then of course, I love Tree Hut. Such great products. This has been my go-to along with this oil and then also the body butter and the body wash. Oh my gosh. Also, Wet n Wild lipstick is so slept on, especially their nudes, like, they're so affordable. They used to be even cheaper than this. I remember they were like 98 cents, but I absolutely love them. Again, here, they don't have a very wide range of selection, but their mattes and their creams and their glosses are perfect. Ooh, this eye looks so nicely organized, but let's move on to like facial skincare and things like that and away from makeup. I've mentioned before, but I really do like this body wash. I also hate that it's gotten so expensive, but you can't find it at TJ Maxx and Marshalls and even Ross, but it does help a lot, so I definitely recommend it. All right, we have some facial cleansers. So I do have, I think it's this one I use when I take a shower. It's okay. My favorite is actually La Rose Poussey, if I said that right, right over here. I like using this. Now, I use this one first, and then I'm like, well, my face, I guess, is oily than this, but I actually like this one more than this one. I feel like this one dries out my face, but this one doesn't. So when I'm ready for a repurchase, I'm definitely going to grab this at $16.99. It is a little pricey but they are worth it and i do wait till there's like a coupon or something that i can use but these are good products 
I have been wanting to try some of their other products, but again, they are pretty expensive. I've tried like a travel size of this and I do like it as well. So I do think it is good and it's worth it, but there are other alternatives that you can use that are a little bit more affordable. I've also heard wonderful things like about their sunscreens. I don't see them out right now, but again, overall, heard so many good things about this brand. I still have yet to try Native. I don't know, like I've smelled a few of them and I just, I don't really like the smell, so I just don't ever end up getting it. Aveeno, I personally don't recommend. I don't have very sensitive skin, but I feel like it has gotten a little bit more sensitive, but it breaks out me and my mom, and we both get rashes using it. L'Oreal has some good products, like this stuff is phenomenal. I really do like it. Um, so is that little soap. I use that to clean my sponges, my makeup sponges with. But lately, their makeup wipes have been making my eyes burn. I love this body wash. It smells so good and it really makes your skin so smooth. So Olay is currently one of my favorite body washes to use, especially this line. It is a little bit more pricey, but it works so well. It also lasts forever. I think this is more of a new product and I want to try it because I do, I can't remember the exact name, but I know KP is short for something, but I do have those bumps like on my arms and like my chest. So I do want to try this out. H-E-B usually has coupons on them, so I'm probably going to get it at H-E-B when they have a coupon. And then if you're new to my channel, I do love using these sprays. I like the ones 100 colors. I feel like those last a little bit longer, but for like a little refresher throughout the day, I do like those and I usually get them at like TJ Maxx, Ross, Marshalls, Burlington, etc. Someone recommended these to me and I've been using it. I like the gel ones, not the solid ones. So far, so good. Very happy. Thank you for the recommendation. I also do really like this brand Flamingo, but they recently started putting it out at Ross and TJ Maxx, or TJ Maxx and Marshalls actually, and it's a lot cheaper, but they're pretty good products and I definitely recommend them. All right, and then this is the toothpaste I use, Sensodyne Pro Namel, so not just Sensodyne, but specifically Sensodyne Pro Namel, and I used the one that says multi-action, but I can't find that one here. But again, this one is my favorite. I swear by it. I go to the dentist regularly, always get compliments on my teeth. They say everything is perfect. I hardly have cavities, thankfully, so I'm gonna have to give a huge shout out to Sensodyne Pro Namel because I think that's why. See my beautiful, beautiful pearly whites. Floss is another really big thing. Please make sure that you're flossing. I don't see the floss that I use here. I use the brand Gum. Love them. My husband loves them. But honestly, you can't go wrong with any of them. But the ones we use are like the ones that are on the stick. Definitely recommend. And then mouthwash. Their breath has been great. I do like this pink one. I think that's the one we've been using recently. Or no, it's the one. It's this one over here. It's like a whitening one i really like it and i do definitely recommend it okay i think we went around i grabbed what i needed so i think we're ready to head out oh girl it is so hot outside y'all probably hear my ac like blasting but it is so freaking hot but i think that's it for today i'm i don't think i'm gonna go to h-e-b because i actually found what i needed here because again i really didn't need that much but i kind of just wanted to get out the house and see what there is if there's any new self-care hygiene little items here and there so i hope you enjoyed today's video stay tuned because soon i will need like a bunch of things i stocked up real good last time so i'm gonna need some things soon so when i do of course i'm gonna take y'all along with me but definitely subscribe if you haven't already I I would love to see y'all back here we have so many more hauls shop with me and also just tell me what y'all want to see because i am so open to filming just about anything i enjoy doing this and i appreciate every single one of y'all i also love interacting with y'all so definitely leave a comment down below i love talking to y'all but thank you so much for watching today's video i hope you have the best day ever and i can't wait to see y'all in my next video bye